Right, welcome everyone to lockdown number 10. I cannot believe that we are in lockdown number 10. I've done 10 of these. Well, I will have done 10 of these when I've done this one. Um, so I was a little bit disappointed in the last two, to be honest with you. I didn't quite get out what I wanted. Uh, what I was hoping to find anyway, should I say. So, yeah, so I've cheated a little bit. And I've not finished off one of the boxes. I've moved on to one of the tubs, which looked a lot more promising. Um, so, yeah, so let's just go in the garage and I'll show you what I mean. Right, so here we are in the garage where I store the remainder of the 3000. And uh, this is the last of the wooden boxes. There were two wooden boxes. Big one on top, if you remember. But anyway, this is the last. So the ones out of here really formed lockdown seven and uh, no, lockdown eight and nine maybe a little bit of seven as well um and i was a little bit disappointed and as this is lockdown 10 i thought no i'm going to go into the next one just to see if i can find some of the cool stuff and sure enough um i mean i, I looked at this and I, I, I what i did really was i just i just go like this i just i don't look at the titles i just look at the labels and just get a feel there's some good stuff there i can see maybe maybe not so good stuff but anyway, I just sort of popped along like that. But I noticed there were some sleeves that looked uh, familiar from earlier finds. So I just grabbed these ones out of here. They look like there's some nice, could be some nice finds in this lot. Those sleeves, again, look familiar to some really nice HMVs that I found. Um, but who knows? Anyway, so I've grabbed some out of here. So that's what we're going to be looking at tonight. Right, so... This is, these are the ones, and mainly these are all out of that tub. Well, I think there's a few that are not, but uh, there's a big, quite a few, hand, big couple of handfuls that come out of that tub. I think this is going to be uh, an exciting, exciting one for me. So let's get on with it. Uh, right, so on the Decker label, I see the moon. Let's get in there. I see the moon, the stargazers with Sid Dean and his orchestra. And on the other side is El Campari. El Campari, is that? That sounds like it might be all right. I'm going to put that on the keep pile. Now, as you know, there's a keep pile, a reject pile, and a to listen to pile. Sorry, I'm just moving stuff about. I am always prepared, as you know. Um, so yeah so that's what we're doing uh but uh, as i say if there's anything here you would like to listen to uh please then just tell me just write uh, just say in the comments what it is and can you also put the video position and it's it's one request per subscriber because i mean i'm struggling to, to do videos as it is really but i just thought it's nice sometimes if you see something and go oh i wonder what that's what that sounds like um do that um yeah, I might be a, a one or two behind at the moment with requests, but I'll get there in the end. Anyway, uh, Phillips uh, Modern Label. There we go. Uh, a Lover's Quarrel, Sarah Vaughan. And I Confess, Sarah Vaughan. Going to put it on the listen to because I need some uh, 50s um, stuff for uh, later on. I will be doing more. I will be doing 50s, uh, 78s in the future. Uh, Vogue Coral Label. Uh, a tear fell, Teresa Brewer, and Bo Weevil. Bo Weevil. Bring it on the listen to pile. Ah, modern Columbia label. You to me, Jimmy Parkinson. And in the middle of the house, Jimmy Parkinson. And do I know this one? I've got a feeling I probably actually know it, but I don't recognise the. Uh, it, it, oh well, if you noticed on here, it's got April, nineteen fifty six. This is a this is a popular place to buy these. This uh, a record record store, Seville Pianos, in uh, Enfield. They come across them quite a lot. Right on the Regal Zonophone. Uh, oh, in the mood. Joe Loss. Now I've got a lot of Joe Loss on, on me, but uh, to be honest with you, I think this was this was probably a better 
a better Joe Loss. And I think the Regal Zonophones are a better one. I think In The Mood was his sort of, um, uh, what, what, what do you call it? Uh, uh, the, 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 the thing that people associated him with. I always associated In The Mood with uh, Glenn Miller, but... <laughs> But for the British uh, British um, orchestra, uh, orchestra band, he was uh, it was that one. So I'm keeping that one. Probably going to keep it actually. So I'm going to put it in a keep keep section. First keep. What's this one? Nice blue, <laughs> nice blue one. It was uh, some nice green ones as well. Perry Como. That goes in the reject. Sorry for you, Perry Como fans. On the Decca label in the Phillips sleeve is oh Ted Heath. Not a Teddy fan. That goes in the reject. We've got reject. We've got one keep, one uh, listen to so far. Modern Columbia label. I love you, Paul Anker. Oh, this is uh, this is more like it. This is more like the 50s stuff, Paul Anker. I've got quite a few of uh, uh, Diane. Is it Diane? I can't remember now. Anyway, okay, that's going in the keep. Is that the keep? Which is the keep? <gasps> oh, no. I messed them all up already. This is the reject. The reject, the keep one, should be actually down here. And these should be the rejects. Right over in the corner. There we go. Get it right, Chris. Uh, piano Pops, Russ Conway. Now, I know I say about pianos and that, but I do like Russ Con Conway, so I'm going to keep him. I do. I do like Russ Conway. I must admit, I don't know why, but I, I'm quite partial. Columbia Label. Ruby Murray, what could be more beautiful? And on the opposite side is Softly Softly. Going to keep that one. As I say, I need some more uh, popular music. 50s popular music, 40s popular music. Oh, Tommy Steele. Now, somebody was asking about Tommy Steele. I've got quite a few Tommy Steeles. I do keep them. I do keep them. But I don't think they're that popular generally. So whether I'll keep them long term is another thing. Oh, Black... Blackberry Winter, Mitch Miller. And the Yellow Rose of Texas. Oh, the Yellow Rose of Texas. Oh, sorry. Don't do that. Don't do that, Chris. Eh, I'll keep it, I think. It's a nice one to have in the, uh, in the um, you know, <laughs> 50s section, I suppose. Mm. Ah, yes. Do you know, I look all... I look... I love to look forward to my weekend to have my little drink because uh, being a being a truck driver um yes is uh i don't uh i can't drink in a week you see so um lazy cowboy on the columbia label is uh ray martin and his oh do you know i don't know really and it's uh the waltzing bugle boy lazy cowboy um yeah and the listen one I'll put it in the listen one. It's in that bloody wallpaper. Look, it's this bloody wallpaper. Oh, I can't even read this one. It's not very really cut out very well. Let's let's um let me even get into it. Where's it? Oh, has it? Oh, it comes out this way. Oh, there we go. <sighs> Summertime in Venice. Ray Martin and his concert orchestra. Tango of Bells. I don't think I'm gonna like this one at all, so I'm gonna put it on a reject. I got a funny feel. I don't know it offhand but it's going in a reject so there we go reject oh more promising stuff here now i was getting a bit worried actually what's this uh and this is cherry red foxtrot pete johnson and his boogie woogie boys that sounds quite more and more like it pete johnson and his boogie woogie baby look at you now we're talking, I think. Now we're talking. Now that's good. That's good. I mean, I was getting a bit worried, to be honest with you. I thought, oh, I've, I've pulled out a load, a load of uh, not so good stuff. And uh, another one. Is this the same? Is this... Uh... Oh, look at this. This is a good find. Dorsey Brothers. Am I blue? And oh, oh dear, they've fallen over. Uh, my kind of love. Oh, that's great. That's that's really good. Now, what's happened here, eh? Oh look, there's some oh there's some nice oh what's this? Oh my god look at this a zonophone in a zonophone sleeve look at that now that that is uh wow that is 
I mean, all right, it's got a bit of tape on this side. But I've never, ever come across a Xonophone record sleeve. And this has to be really old. I mean, the record itself. Let's have a look. Uh, many happy returns of the day. Blocks here. Let's have a close-up look there so you can see. And look on the other side. It's uh, the vacant chair. Peter. Is it Peter Dawson? Peter Dawson. In an original... That's got to be original. And this has got to be 100 years old, surely. Is it? Feels feels old. It feels heavy, thick. And that is an original Xonophone record sleeve. Wow, wow, wow. Putting this somewhere special because that can't be damaged. I'm going to put it on top of my cabinet over there. That is a, That was brilliant. That was a great find. I was really chuffed with that. Uh, oh, there's a lots of writing on this one. Uh, Peter Dawson. Yes, this guy's written a lot of stuff on here. Uh, it's Peter Tizai. Peter Dawson on EHMV. And the Darling Girl from Clare. I'm not sure if I'm going to like Peter Dawson. Rings a bell. He's written a lot of stuff on here. Look, we go there. And we'll go over here. Make sure you can see it. There we go. 1930, it says. I think it might be all right, actually. Um, let's have a look. He's written a lot of stuff, both sides. Wow. Um, there's a baritone. This is not normally what I like, but because of, well, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to, well, I'm going to put it on the listen to. Listen to. Right, another HMV. Oh, what's this? Shenando, Shenando, oh, do you know what? I'm gonna stop. Just my song, Paul Robinson. Now, now you see, I, I don't generally like Paul Robinson. There's only, <sighs> I don't think I'm gonna like this at all. I'm gonna, uh, where am I gonna put it? Ah, uh, I've gotta. Put it on the listen to. I'm mad. I'm mad. Oh my God! Look, I didn't notice this. This is a Bing Crosby, and it's a, look at this. Oh, that is just made my day. This has made my day. This is my second um, picture label on the Brunswick label, and this is amazing because I've I, they're not that common. I've been on eBay to have a look since I got the first one, the Dorsey, Jimmy Dorsey one, um, which was in the last the last uh, lockdown. I showed you it. No, it was only it was a lockdown nine, was it? No, it was an eight. I showed you at the beginning because I I messed up a, a little bit on eight, but that is amazing. Now, what have we got? Oh, in a little hula heaven. There's a little stain on it there, but I might be able to get that out. You know, if I'm careful. I don't want to be too rough with it, but sweet Lelani. Oh wow, that's a that is a wow. Guess where that's going? <laughs> that's right on the reject. No, I'm only joking. That's going straight on the keep. That was only, that's great. That's that's two really brilliant finds so far. What's this one? Concerto for trumpet. Harry James and his orchestra. Harry James and his orchestra. Trumpet blues. And content, contable, cant, cantable. Sorry, I'm rubbish. I know I should really give up trying to pronounce stuff in that because I'll just make a fool of myself. Uh, right, so got quite a nice little keep pile there growing. I think we have, haven't we? What was on this one? Yeah, we have. Yes, nice little keep pile growing here. Oh, now I know this label. I know, well, I know this. This is from a, a, a collector, so that's great news to me, finding this, because that means there's more of this, more of this, maybe, there's some have got chopped here and there. So when there's, there's several collections in the 3000, right, um, several collections all together, so the whole lot was a job lot, but it was several job lots, so several collections. And when I, I notice a sleeve and I notice stuff like this, I know that that's from a certain collection. So I would say there was about, I think there was three collectors who collected jazz, and there's one big, big jazz collector, which most of my Brunswick, Brunswick's 
a lot of my parlor phones and my HMVs come from. Uh, I, can, I noticed this because of the way they've been written on or they've been uh, numbered and stuff like this. So, well, uh, piano solo. All right, so I'm not, a, I'm not someone who loves piano, but this has uh, got to be kept. But yeah, but that 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 that's that's really cheered me up as well because I think there might be more of this. There might be more of this. Oh, we've got a oh, we've got a double one here. Two in a in a in a. What we got? Oh, Frankie Vaughan Green Door. I've already got that one. It's a badly damaged, so that's on the reject pile. Uh, Michael Torok. I don't think I'm a fan. I think I did try listening. To Michael Torrett, but I'm not a fan, so we're going to put that into the reject. Oh, time for a drink! I can calm myself down because I'm still reeling from that picture sleeve, uh, picture um, label. Hmm. I wonder if that's two. That's two picture labels now. I'm wondering if there's a collection of more somewhere, because I say when these got all put in the in these tubs and that and sorted out, somebody would have grabbed some, put some somewhere, put some another way. Put some here, put some there, and they all got mixed up. I don't want to be kissed by anyone but you with Ray Noble and his orchestra on this Columbia label here. And on the other side, it's Festival of Roses, Doris Day. Keeping that one, and I, I like Doris Day on the Columbia. I, I, must, I must admit, broadcast 12, and this is about, I think this is a, a third broadcast 12 i've found in its sleeve and look at that it's lovely to find them in original sleeves like this just lovely um double-sided two shillings uh, <laughs> this is when it says double double-sided like you know you know this is going back a bit uh el travel tour or something is it grand opera company with full orchestra well i'm going to keep this because I display, I'm trying to work out a way I'm trying to display something. I mean, that's a nice display, even if I don't like it. Oh, another one here, but not in its sleeve. Poet and peasant and pheasant. Peasant, peasant, sorry. Poet and peasant, symphony orchestra on this uh, broadcast 12. They say, they're called broadcast 12, I think, because they say you can, they get, they get as much music from a 10 inch then you do for as a 12 inch i think that's why it's called broadcast 12 because although it's 10 you get you get 12 inch 12 inches worth of music from it i think that's right rex label now am i lucky i always sometimes i am sometimes i'm not i would say the majority of my rexes have been pretty lax at times but who's this by robert naylor tanner mm. let's have a look shall we gems from blossom time I don't think I'm gonna. Shall I? No, I'm gonna put it on a reach up. I, I, I can't have the time to listen to too many. I don't listen to them all anyway. What I usually do is I put them on the uh, turntable and just have a quick listen like that. Christmas leave. Old old Bill. Old Bill and Harry going home on this uh, Panacord label. Christmas leave. I have a Christmas collection, so I'm keeping it uh, just in case it's only worthwhile. Now Dominion label on its own no sleeve uh is theme song from vitaphone pictures waltz vocal refrain blah 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 i'm not sure i've never liked any of these so far i think i've come across one that i've i've never seen a smile like yours now this is a foxtrot and it's from the perfect something uh, a bill i don't know what do you think i'm going to keep it as a listen there we go it's as a listen regal zonophone make it party billy cotton and his billy cotton uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna keep it i have got some billy cotton that i've kept so I'm going to keep this one. Oh, that sleeve, that sleeve with that writing on. I know it's going to be good. I know it's going to be good. 
it's going to be good isn't it oh is it <laughs> i can't read the uh the label, the label properly is it something dragon mary lou williams 1931 what do i care what someone said what somebody said the mound city blue blowers i don't know it but i know that's good and it's, it's staying it's staying in there oh and there's a oh a rex label oh, no it's a decker the street singer south of border with orchestral accompaniment what do you think to that Ah, oh, I don't know. On the, on the listen to pile. On the listen to pile. Here we go. Regal Zonophone. Old Bowman Bowman Town Tango. Uh, don't know about this. Rain Foxtrot. Oh, that's a Foxtrot. I'll have a listen to it. Can have a listen to that one. Uh, Regal is on a phone. Billy Cotton again. Oh, look, they're all falling down again. Great. Yeah, we'll keep it. Especially as it's on a Regal's on a phone as well. And uh, I don't think the other ones I've got are on. Uh, Decker, are they? Oh, this could be good. Oh, is this? Oh, look at that. Oh, back to that in a minute. Hold on. Uh, Indiana, Harry James and his orchestra. So, is this the second Harry James we've got out of here? Record session. Well, I think that's a good keep. I think that's a good keep, definitely. Keeps are quite good, actually. They're building up quite well. Look at this sleeve. That's a lovely sleeve. Is that the right sleeve for this? I don't think it is, is it? That should be a black label, should it not? But that's a nice sleeve, isn't it? Look at that. It's a nice sleeve. Yeah. What's it? What's on the record? Yeah. Party Party, Harry Parry and his radio sextet. Hmm. Gone with the wind. Harry Parry and his radio sextet. Oh, well, we're going to we'll tell you what. That's keeping that anyway. Definite. It's a definite keep. Modern Brunswick. Uh, I'll be falling down the wayside now. I wish I was a bit younger. Michael Torek again. And on the other side is when Mexico gave up the rumba. Going on the reject, I'm afraid. Phillips. Frankie Lane. I, I, sh I should li really keep the Frankie Lanes for the 50s, shouldn't I? I'm not a massive fan of Frankie Lane, to be honest with you. And I think I have moved some on, so I'm going to move this one on. Sorry. Uh, it's in the reject. Phillips. Such a night. Johnny Ray. And an, an orchard for the lady. Orchid for the lady. Oh, I'm terrible. You know? I, I, I shouldn't bother, really, should I? I should just push them up and let you read them. Because you. <laughs> well, am I going to keep this one? Just Johnny Ray. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to put it in the listen to pile. There we go. Tell you what, let's have another slurp. We're getting near the end now. Of course, you can always pause this or stop it and come back to it if you get bored, right? You know, that's what I sometimes do. I, well, I don't get bored. I just... And for something a long video I've got to watch, then I I do it in bits. But uh, Gilly Billy often f f blah 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 by the sea. <laughs> Have a listen. Uh, gonna, no, I'm not gonna, I'm not going to try that. Three coins in a fountain. Now I like that one, and it was sung by um, Frank Sinatra. It was a nice one. So lumber. It's called by the lumberjacks, isn't it? Three coins in a fountain. La da 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 da. No, I better not. Mm. I see if I have too much of this, then I will start singing, and then you'll all be unsubscribing from me. I know that. <laughs> On the capital label. Yeah. Oh, God, why can't they just use English? By the Banjo Boys. Hey, Mr. Banjo. By the Banjo Boys. That's something I listen, listen to, listen to, pile. So far, the keep pile is actually thicker than the uh, reject and the listen to's. The reject and the listen to's are both the same size. The keep pile is bigger, nearly twice the size. That's great, isn't it? Oh, yes. Another copy of this. This is fantastic. Look at what I've got. Rock around the clock. Bill Haley and 13 women on. Now, this is a good find. Let's have a look. Let's check it out. What conditions it in. 
Well, it's not in hugely bad condition, actually. It's, it's, I've seen worse, a lot worse than that. I have got a copy of this already, so I think this is a better copy than the one I've got. So, good old Bill Haley. Thank you very much. Two rock around the clocks. That's great. Another 50s here. Uh, you shouldn't do that, Jim Dale. Be my girl, Jim Dale. We'll keep that, I think, as... Well, me 50s. I will be going through my 50s eventually one day and uh, we'll, 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 we'll have a look and see what we've got and what we're going to keep, what we're not going to keep. But at the moment, the four aces. I've got a four aces somewhere. I didn't like it, I don't think. A garden in the rain. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm going to put it on a rejet. But if you think it's really good, you think I would like it, then let me know in the comments. Another 50s. Phillips just walking in the rain. I like this one. This is Johnny Ray, but I do like this one. Just walking in the rain. La da 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 dee. Phillips one coming up here. Oh, double sleeved somehow. <sighs> Sweet po potato. The Noble Sisters Swingsters. Look at that. Oh, that's a good one. That's going to be a good one. And Viper, Viper Mad. Again, by... The Noble Sisters Swingsters. Good, good one. Look, it's been written on. This, this guy is the jazz guy. This is one of the jazz guys. Number eight. Yes. Yes, good one. Good, good find, good find. Another. Oh, is this going to be a, nice, a few nice ones here? Is there? Bump it up. Oh, bump it. The bumps. Jimmy, Jimmy Noon and his orchestra. Nice. Four or five times. Nice. Look, number seven. Wow. Could have a little collection here. Is this going to be another one? Oh, I think we're coming to the end. Walking the dog. <coughs> Sorry, I had to sneeze like that, but it just happened, you know. Um, walking the dog, Hoggy Carmichael and his collagens. 1928. Look at that. There's the other side. Wow. Uh, shake that thing. Barbecue Joe and his hot dogs. 1927, 28, it says on there. Right, we've got uh, coming to the end here. This Timberjack. Oh, Timberjack. I know this one. I can't remember how. Oh, crazy music. I'm going to keep that on the listen path. Modern Decker, oh, uh, two modern ones now, so we're coming to the end. Close the door, the Stargazers, and I've got four big brothers. Have you now? Well, that's that's handy. On the listen to, is this the last one? Oh, I think it is, is it? Oh, there's two in one here. Oh, two moderns. Decker, Christmas and You, Dave King. So another Christmas one to keep. And uh, you make nice, you make nice. And as I believe, Frankie Lane, oh, I believe, da 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 da. I don't know any words to it, so I just know it's uh, well, it's had a bit of a hard life, isn't it? The cheat, your cheating heart. Well, there you go, we know that one, don't we? So we'll put those on the uh, uh I think they're in bad condition, but I'm gonna put them on the listen part because I don't think they're in that great condition, anyway. There we are. Massive big keep keep lot here. Let's get it up so you can see. Can you see that? There we are. They're all keeps. And uh, a highlight has to be. Can I find it quickly? I don't know. Got to be around here somewhere. I've got to be at the bottom around here somewhere. Can I find it? There it is. This is the highlight for me. Another picture label. And uh, condition, mm. so so hard to tell really. But to play it, but it doesn't look like it's been overly played. But you know, I think it has a it's had a bit of playing. We'll see what it's like anyway. Anyway, thank you for watching number 10. If you're a bit of following the uh lockdown sort throughs, that's uh great. And uh, I really enjoy doing these, I enjoy doing them because I feel like when I'm doing them, I'm actually got someone here with me 
so that's great uh yeah so yeah again thanks very much and i uh, hope you enjoyed this one and i'll see you in lockdown number 11 cheers everyone keep safe hmm very nice